Hey guys, let's talk about the Dell Laptop BIOS Flash Update. Let's say, for example, you can't load the Windows on your Dell's laptop and you need to update from a thumb drive. First, I have the Windows running here on my Dell's laptop because I need to download the file, okay? If your computer is not running Windows yet because you have some problem, you need to use a different computer just to download the file, okay? And you also need a thumb drive like this one to insert the file and then you can flash the BIOS, all right? So here, uh, what I can do is just visit the web, Dell's website to look for the firmware. Here, you just look for Dell drivers and downloads. There we go. In here, you need to identify the product here. If you know the computer they're using, like Dell Latitude, for example, you can just insert the information here, okay? For a Dell Latitude, or if you have the service tag, which is better, just make sure that you have uh, the number of uh, the service tag, for example, then you know for sure which computer you're going to download the BIOS, okay? Uh, the BIOS file. Uh, there's a way also to check the service tag. If you can't boot your computer, you can go into the BIOS and see the service tag there, okay? Later, I'm gonna show you where we can find this service tag. But basically here, I know the computer that I have already, right? So I, I can just come here and say that's this PC. And here, sometimes a uh, Windows pops up here, just need to close it down. And down here, look for drivers, right? Select drivers. Here, look for BIOS, just type here BIOS, hit enter. And down here, gonna see the Dell Latitude System BIOS, that's the one that I want. Just select here and click download. It downloads here to my laptop. There we go. And then I just need to insert a thumb drive like this one, format it and copy the file here, right? Let me just insert here. And then I see here the thumb drive, right click on it and format it, right? Here you need to select the FAT32 and you can give it a name if you want to. I would just leave like this, no name. Start, hit OK, wait for it to format. You can use a quick format, right? You don't need to use a com complete format because it takes a while. So just wait. So it finishes here. I just close this down and I drag and drop to copy here. There we go. It's pretty fast. Just make sure that's there. Okay. And you're good to go. Now you can just restart your computer and use the thumb drive here to um, update the BIOS, okay? Or in your case, if you don't have like the computer up on Windows, you can just put that thumb drive on your computer there you want to flash the BIOS, okay? So I'm going to restart here because I have the same computer that I'm downloading the file. It's the same one that I need to flash the BIOS, right? Let's just wait for a restart. And here I'm gonna use the F12 key as a way to get into the menu, to the boot menu, right? But first I can get into the uh, BIOS set up here by pressing F2 during the startup, the restart, right? Just keep pressing here before you see this logo. There we go. It's going to get into the, the BIOS setup. And here you see that I have the information just click here on system information. I have here the service tag, all right? And uh, sometimes, depending on the model, perhaps you can find here a way to update uh, the BIOS, right? So if you look here, you see a lot of things about BIOS, uh, boot and things, things like this, right? But I didn't find here, at least on the Dell Latitude 7490, I didn't find here, okay? If you found there uh, a way to update from here, just let me know here in the comments. But for me, what works is just exit here and just press F12 instead, right? During uh, the boot up, right? So I just got into the BIOS here using F2 to see the service tag. Now I'm getting to the boot menu by pressing F12. There we go. And here you see that I have this, this option for BIOS flash update. So I just come down, hit enter, wait for it to load the interface, 
And in this interface, you can even use the mouse, right? So here you select the BIOS update file, just click here. And here you see the file system. See that we have different ones here, FS0, 1, 2, and 3. Uh, sometimes, I don't know why, if you like insert the thumb drive later, you're gonna see this on FS3. You see, but right now it's not, it's in FS0 because the drive was already here when the system was booting up, right? So here's the file. So just make sure that you have the correct one, I'm pretty sure. And then it just hit OK. It's going to confirm here. That's the file. And you just hit here, begin flash update, okay? And just remember to have the cable connected here. Don't disconnect the power cable during the process. Otherwise, you're gonna damage your BIOS, right? So just click here and hit yes. It's going to reload here. Sometimes you just see a black screen. Don't worry, just wait for it to come up with something. And also the message here, you need to just follow them, right? If the message gets stuck for some time, you just need to wait. See here right now it's updating the firmware. And you can see here the progress, it goes from screen to screen, it's updating different things here. Sometimes it just says that uh, some things are already up to date. Just follow the information here, but never turn off your computer. If you see here, for example, that it gets stuck at 99% or 100%, sometimes it does. Don't worry, just wait, be patient and wait for it to finish. Usually you're gonna see a green message here when everything is done, okay? It depends on the laptop that you have, but usually you're gonna see the information that everything is already done, right? It's complete here with the firmware update. You see, it's fairly fast to update. Some of the screens here takes a longer time. Some of them are, are faster, but it works anyway. You see here that got stuck at 99% for some time. Just be patient and wait. Now 100%, it stays there for a while as well. Just wait. It's going to do something else. You see that says uh, the update was successful for part of the thing here. There's something else that's uh, still happening. You see here is already update, something's already up to date. Still updating something else. There we go. Firmware update successful, 100%. Just wait, you're gonna see the green message here. There we go. It's going to reboot the system by itself. I didn't need to reboot the PC or the laptop just reboot by itself. And now you're gonna see the Dell logo. And if everything is working for you, you're gonna see also a spinning thing here, right? Spinning wheel. And then it's going to load your windows. And if everything is correct, you're gonna find your Windows working. There we go, it's working, okay? So I hope that helps. That's the way you can update the BIOS using a thumb drive here on your Dell laptop, okay? Hope this helps. Leave your comments here if it, that works for you, if it doesn't work for you, if there is something different, right? Because your comment can help somebody else here that they're looking for more information. They also read the comments. I hope you liked this video. Please subscribe to the channel, leave your thumbs up in your comments, and I see you in the next video.